Hi there, I'm Roberto Blake, and today we're gonna to dive into the Premiere Pro export settings. When you're ready to export your project in Premiere Pro, there are a few key things you're gonna to wanna to do. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna select our in point and we're gonna use shortcut I to do that. This is gonna tell us where the video is gonna begin when we look at the final project. Next, we're gonna select our out point. And we're gonna use shortcut O to do that. Now make sure that this is snapping to the correct place in your timeline. You could hold down the shift key and while you're scrubbing through your timeline, this will go ahead and align to any stop points in the footage. We're gonna to wanna to go to file, export, media. You can also use command or control M and that will bring up the same export options. Once you're in the export settings, you get to choose your format. I usually go with the H.264 codec. And then in terms of your options, you could use presets for whatever platform you want to export to, whether it's YouTube or any other platform. Once you're satisfied with your settings, you can hit export and you're all done, or you have the option to queue this into Adobe Media Encoder, where you could actually export multiple videos at once. I use Adobe Media Encoder when I want to create different file sizes or different file formats, maybe presets matched to different platforms, and it's a really great and useful feature in Premiere Pro. So there you go, a very quick way to go ahead and export your files perfectly in Adobe Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching this tutorial, stay awesome, and be sure to check out the other videos in the Learn from the Pros series from Adobe.